everybody. I apologize for the bad view. Hey, what's up, people? Welcome to Riding on Ruby. Well, I'm going to go out for a little ride. Filed for unemployment like two or probably more like three weeks ago. They owed us two checks. So I checked this morning online and it finally said payment for both checks. So maybe it'll be in the next couple of days. But in the meantime, I'm going to run up to the smoke shop and... uh I got about $40 worth of uh, instant scratch-off winners, so that's a good reason to go for a ride to me. Go cash them in, get a little cash, maybe pick up some more tobacco or something. So anyways, there was a helicopter flying around, circling around this whole area for about 15 minutes. You know, I don't like seeing that. You know, it always makes me nervous when I see some helicopter just floating around being all black and all that. It wasn't like a news channel, but anyways. So, hey, Red Rider Angel. Oh, sorry I missed your, uh, most of your live. I went back and I replayed and watched it, but I, I guess I dozed off like around 9 or 10. And then I got a text and then I from Motobomb Virginia so thank you Motobomb Virginia for that text and uh, I ended up uh, checking it and it says oh Red Rider is doing a live so I popped on half asleep though but I did catch the end of it so yeah the night before I was one of, one of those nights where you just toss and turn all night long you know ever since my wife died in 2020 I don't think I've ever slept a full night yet so some some nights are rougher than the others all right well anyways enough of bitching and complaining gonna be getting some fuel soon too go cool. don't want to kill my hydrangeas all right it's a little warm today now I'm wearing the Captain America open face helmet with the cheap $9 mic and I'm wearing a chest harness but the and I still love that view but the only problem is I don't even know what you call it, but that little base part where you screw the, you know, the GoPro into it to hold it. I had one that was kind of raised a little bit. And, uh, it had one of, one of the little, uh, I don't know, I'll call them like fingers that go in there and lock up. Well, one of those was broken, so it was, you know, in there, it wouldn't come out, but... I decided, well, let me uh, pull it out and turn it around. Well, when I pulled it out, well, now it won't go back in because it's missing one of those little fingers that lock into place. So, luckily, I had another one, but it's a lot smaller, like it's shorter, like it's really close to the main base. So, because of that... I guess this car is going to take their turn. So I guess because of that being uh, shorter, I can't really lean the GoPro up a little bit on the chest harness. So you could hopefully see a lot of the view ahead. So I'm not sure how this is going to look until I edit it, but hopefully I'm trying to sit up like weird and lean back a little bit so you can still see but a nice day to ride
So what's today? It is Tuesday the 2nd, July 2024. So Thursday is our 4th of July, Independence Day. It's just funny how when you're riding with an open face, the wind is so strong that you can barely hear yourself talk, but luckily it comes out a lot better in a mic. And I mean, that's like one thing that I find through almost anybody that's doing a riding video. It's always that concern about the wind. And I just gave up, I, you know. You're gonna get wind no matter what. Even when I wear my full face, you could still hear a little bit of wind in there. So, I don't think no matter what you do, you're always gonna hear it. So, might as well live with it, right? those carbs even though I blew them out so good it turned into fuel injection Woohoo! oh wow nobody here I'm gonna shut you down though because a lot of people don't like you going in their business with cameras Well, see, I've been finding neutral a lot easier lately. All right, this looks good. All right, people. See you in a little bit. I tend to be in there yapping for a while. All right, catch you in a little bit. Hopefully, it's still recording. Trying to look down and see, but I can't see nothing. All right, what else, people? I'm out. Had a nice little conversation with the guy. Yeah, it's getting a little bit on the warm side now. It's probably around close to 80 already, so. Just get home. I gotta start getting caught up on a bunch of things, but I'll spend a couple hours trying to get this all uploaded. I'm pretty sure my iPad's probably full. I probably only have like three or four gigs of memory left, so that means I gotta go in there and delete half of my videos. You know, I usually delete the full video that I put on YouTube, but all the different segments that you get from the GoPro I usually will keep them in case I want to go back and throw a couple together to make a short or a smaller like two or three minute video like edit video something like that all right uh, I don't know what that metal thing is but we better go around it The jungle, the mighty jungle, the Lyran sleeps. It's a beautiful morning. All right, I just lost about 50 subscribers with that song. <laughs> Sorry, people.
Whee! Are you seasick yet? I don't like this spot right here because you can't see with that big tree, which you couldn't see the tree. Now I have a black open face helmet and one of that, that was the very first helmet I had when I got Ruby. And the very first video I did you know, first right or something like that of uh, 2021, I think it was. That, that video's got like 13,000 views for me. <laughs> That's a miracle. But if you ever watched that one, you could see the purple panda cat sticking out the right side of the, of the helmet because it had the like little shield on it too. So I would open that, you know, and pull it down, but it never did a darn thing as far as wind. But on that one, I mounted the GoPro on the right side of the helmet, sticking out the side. And a lot of people do that, but I don't know, it just, one, it just felt weird with, you know, I got this camera sticking out the side of my head, you know. And then, I don't know, you couldn't really see a lot of the view. And then that's why I decided between the wind and uh, the mic set up that I would get a full face. And now it's on the chin, so if I look around, you can see what I'm looking at and all that. But I really love this chest harness, but I think I'm going to have to go search uh, Amazon or Walmart.com or something and and see uh, I sir <laughs> see if I could find uh, one of these uh, bases for it with a, a taller you know teeth there to you screw the GoPro into so this way it'll give me more room to lean the camera back more I mean you could probably see this right here I could put it on there too but I like seeing the bike. Yeah, it's getting pretty warm. I shop at Walmarts and Walmart.com so much people call me Paul Mart. Ooh, ah, uh, ooh, 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 ooh. So I figured I wouldn't put up a big video, you know, like a 30 minute one or something like that. So this one might be about 20, I don't know, 25. Depends on how much stuff I add to it. Hopefully the mic and camera's recording and all that, you know. That's the only thing about these GoPros is every time you go out and make a video, you always got to... You always got to wonder, is this thing working, you know? Is it recording? Is the mic working? Alright, peoples. I don't know, how come my, my thing wasn't blinking? Alright, easy. Go around the hydrangeas, well, kind of threw them a little bit. <laughs> Oopsie. Alright, let's hit neutral, look at that, bam, right into neutral, holy moly, Batman. Alright, people. We made it there and back safely. Good job, Ruby. Uh, let's get my tobacco out. And my box of tubes. Hopefully I didn't crush them too much. 
Now these saddlebags aren't the biggest, but they they work for me. I mean, if you didn't, you probably didn't see that video I did. I think it was the two-year review, or no, I think it was a nine-month review video in saddlebags. Well, I ended up looking up the saddlebags. These are throwover leather ones, and I ended up getting them from uh, Amazon. But when I was looking, I think they were like $127. But then Amazon had a deal where, hello, Red Rider. Hello, Hippie Trev. So they had a deal where if you decided to apply for the uh, Amazon card, then they take a hundred bucks off. So I'm like, all right, why not? All right, that was my backyard camera telling me someone's in the back. So uh, I did that. So I ended up getting these $127 throwover saddlebags for $27. So, I mean, <laughs> you can't beat a deal like that. All right, people. I'm back. Out of breath. Should stop smoking. Especially with having night asthma, but, you know... Back when I grew up in the 60s, you know, smoking was a big thing. They had the Marlboro Man. Every time you watch the movie or TV show, the people are smoking. You know, TV had ads all over for Marlboro and Cool and all these things. And now it's like, oh, you can't smoke. You know, it's bad for you. Yeah, all right, well, whatever. Breathing all the, the chemtrails is like that's good for me. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> all right, people. I better shut up. Have a great day. Ride safe. Like, subscribe, hit the ding-a-ling bell. See you in the next video, people. Peace out.